This is Wednesday, July 5th, 2022. Right there is the Suncrook River, Short Falls, Epsom. Looking at a standing wave. Yeah. I was away for six days up to my camp in Maine with family for the holiday. And uh, here we are. We got some rain, so we got some water here in the Suncrook River. I came home and my rain gauges had just under three inches of rain in them. I have four rain gauges. <laughs> and uh, yeah, looking at four inches of, I mean, three inches of rain in my rain gauges and uh, Sun Cook's flowing pretty good not a high flood stage you know kind of a low flood stage more than anything else not really all that much as far as flood conditions here on the Sun Cook River But, uh, we've had some rain, haven't we? Oh, there's the Sundcook River. Wednesday afternoon, July 5th, 2023. Low flood stage, not high, low. Looking up that way. Plenty of water in the river, all right. It's flowing good. <laughs> Some different than last year. Last year, this river was a trickle by uh, July and uh, practically dried up last summer. Big difference this year. We've had steady rains really since April. A lot of rain, plenty of water. Sun Cook River flowing strong today. Wednesday, July 5th, 2023. This is wildlife biologist Eric Orr for what's wild in New Hampshire. <laughs> the Suncook River, Short Falls Epsom is wild tonight. 